A few days ago, one of my cousins said to me, hey, Winston, go to the United States of America. And I was like, why? He was like, it's a dream come true. Now, being this very patriotic South African and somebody who loves my city, Durban, very much, I thought, you know what? I'm going to defend my city at all costs. So I was like, why should I go to America? Everything America has, Durban has. Even the names of our places America stole. Now, this cousin of mine was all lost. So he says to me, prove it. I said, yes, of course. I live in Phoenix, Arizona. I'm two minutes from Ottawa. Five minutes away from Ottawa is a very popular place known as the Trade Center. From the Trade Center down toward Mount Edgecombe, just two minutes away, is a very popular place called the White House. 20 minutes away from the White House is Hollywood. I got nothing to worry about. Everything America has, we have. And the guy was like, let me tell you, in America, we have hip hop that compares to nothing in the world. We have the West Side and the East Side. I was like, hey, if you come to Phoenix, we got Kane Side. And this guy was going on and on and on. And he was like, we have Jay-Z, one of the best hip hop artists in the world. I said, hey, come to South Africa. We have Jacob Zuma, one of the best presidents in the world. And my cousin was just getting frustrated, you know, because I was keep defending Durban. And he was like, you know what? We have a central park. I said, well, no problem. If you live in Phoenix, anywhere in Sastry Park or Tenants Manor, you will know we have a central park too. I think my cousin had it up to his neck. He couldn't take any more of this. And he was like, come to South Beach, Florida. You will think you are in paradise. It is fantastic. It is fantasia. I said, hey, come to South Beach in Durban. You will think you're in Nigeria.